Hey guys, hey, this is Dr. Ty here. You know, I want to spend just a couple minutes this morning talking about neuropathy and what it can actually do to you. So here, as you can see, this is a wheelchair. And unfortunately, this is a reality that most people with neuropathy will eventually experience if they don't do something about it, right? So let's talk a little bit about what neuropathy is and why does it lead to this? Neuropathy is a condition that destroys nerves. Now, what causes neuropathy? It can happen from diabetes, chemotherapy, circulatory problems, heart-related issues, medication side effects like uh, high blood pressure and uh, cholesterol medications. It can happen from as well as spinal surgery. If you, you know, I've seen patients that had sciatic nerve pain at one point and then also turned into neuropathy. So really the, the kind of list goes on and on and that's why we see the numbers of people dealing with neuropathy are actually going up. Another reason why you know it is, is look on TV. How many times have you seen a commercial for Cymbalto or Lyrica or Gabapentin or Rotten, right? These drug companies are real smart. They know that if there's a problem out there and they keep advertising, you're going to go and ask your doctor, hey, I got neuropathy. I have these symptoms. I've got this numbness, this tingling, this burning, this pain. And then now it's bothering me. Well, what does your doctor do? Prescribes you these medications. Now, it's great if these medications actually repair the nerve. But when we look at what they do, they don't. They tell your body that, hey, you don't have a problem at that moment. But the longer this goes on, what happens to the problem? It just gets worse. It gets worse to the point now where these nerves don't work. And remember, these nerves control motor, which is movement, and sensory, which is feeling. And as that continues to go, that's how you end up in a wheelchair, right? So if you have neuropathy, what do you do, right? The first thing is we got to start looking at what the root cause is. If you're a diabetic, you got to look at the diabetes. And we're not talking about managing it with medications. We're talking about changing your lifestyle, doing the right things that you have to do to actually make a change, right? If you have it from chemotherapy, and I know it's tough going through chemo, you fought for your life and, and now you're cancer free, which is fantastic. You should not let this continue to bother you. You don't deserve that. After all the things and all the stress and the struggles you went through, now it's time to live again. The great thing is peripheral nerves, and those are the nerves in your hands and your feet, are designed to regenerate but they can't because our body just isn't in that position. If you provide it with the right environment, the proper protein production, the uh, proper nutrients, you can now cause that nerve to regenerate. Well, how do I know this? I know this because I've been doing this for a long time now. I've treated thousands of patients at this point successfully. We've got so many videos. We've got so many people that graduate from our office and we call them neuropathy warriors. And neuropathy warrior is a person who has fought and struggled and been through it and now they don't have neuropathy anymore, or they're to the point where it barely even bothers them. Ask yourself this, if you have neuropathy, do you wanna be a neuropathy warrior? Okay, so neuropathy is something you shouldn't uh, take for granted, otherwise you'll end up like that, okay? So if you guys have neuropathy, please have hope, number one, to come into our office. Let's see what we can do for you, and let's see if you are our next neuropathy warrior.